Hi guys! Today I want to give you guys a few quick tips how to work on a picture in Lightroom when that picture has been taken on a cloudy day. So we have this beautiful parliament building and we have a quite dramatic sky behind. So first step first I will look at this picture and see we have a main subject and a dramatic sky behind. So that'll give me two things to mainly work on. So here it is. I will start with my right side here, you'll take a look there, there's a few function exposure, contrast, highlights and whatnot. If I find my building is too dark and I want to brighten the building, if I go with the exposure, I can do that, but the sky will change as well and I'm losing all the details in there. So I'm not going to play with the exposure right away. The shadows. If I play with the shadows, you'll see my sky doesn't change a whole lot, but my building change and get brighter. See what I'm doing in my cursor here? I'm moving my slider back and forth and I will find a happy medium this way. It's around here. For the clouds, I will use the highlights. The highlights is a great tool to darken skies and specifically clouds to bring more details. So again, if I play with my highlights, you'll see my building won't change a whole lot, but my cloud will get more details into it. So, I will find again a happy medium somewhere around, let's see, just here. What I can do, because I'm with Lightroom here, I can use a brush. So, you can tell my exposure is up. So, what I'll do is I will quickly paint. Now, you can take your time at home. I'll do that very, very quickly right now, just to give you a general idea what I'm doing here. So, I'm just going on the edge there. And I will paint everywhere. If you want to make sure you didn't miss a spot, so what you can do is you can put your mouse over that little round spot, and everywhere you see it's red, that means you painted on. So let's say I'm happy with this. So that could be a, just a little much exposure. We'll bring it down to maybe here. So my building is very bright right now. It's a little flat as well. So I would use the clarity. Clarity is a great tool to add a little bit of contrast as well as a little bit of detail. If you go too far, it's too much, you're gonna find again your happy medium, which in this case will be, let's say, around here. And we'll press done. So we're done with this brush. Now my building is way too bright. And my sky is not as dark as I wanted. I did that on purpose. Now I can use the main exposure for my picture and bring it down to the desired level. Now if you can take a look I have a building which I can see quite a bit of detail which pop a little bit more in a very dramatic sky if you go back to the original picture you see how flat it is versus this one so those were quick little tips to help you guys now if you take a look at this picture like this there's a nice pop to it it didn't took me a whole lot of time and it's very easy to uh, create. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this tutorial and make sure to subscribe to my channels and look at my website and there will be some more coming up. See you guys.